going on guys? Welcome to Hidden Heights Farm and I'm Kevin. So just got off work and trying to get all my chores done. We have another winter storm moving in the night with some freezing rain. So I got everybody's water filled up, got the water heaters plugged in. Um, one thing before I forget, I want to remind you guys we do have a Facebook page set up under Hidden Heights Farm. Go to Facebook and type in Hidden Heights Farm and you should pull it up. Uh, my wife maintains that. She tries to update it daily. Uh, things that we've got going on around the farm and such. So if you guys go like that page, you can kind of follow us for the days that I don't always post videos. You can keep up with us on there. Um, I want to talk to you guys about a product that we used. And man, this thing has saved us several times. So you guys know about the... Uh, twins that we had born just the other day and the twin didn't make it one of the little boys didn't make it so the other one it's it's surviving and it's been out and about we let it out of the barn because the weather's been pretty nice i'm out here in a t-shirt it's like in the 60s right now so anyways we let that baby out and his mama and it's been moping around just hasn't acted like itself so me and my wife came out here yesterday and we gave it a shot of this power punch. Um, it says one ounce per 100 pounds of body weight, so you can kind of do the math and calculate how much you need to give a kid, a small kid. <clears throat> but anyways, we gave that kid a little syringe full of this stuff. He just wasn't acting right. Like, he didn't act like he was feeling good. He was following the other kids around, but he wasn't really playing with them or anything. So, we gave him a shot of this stuff last night, uh, orally in the mouth, and today he was a whole different goat. He was, this was the first time he's been out here playing. Uh, we never did actually see him chase his mom around like the other babies do and drink milk from his mom, but today when I got off work, I started feeding the goats, and of course they all come running, and that baby was right behind his mom and was sucking off of her, drinking her milk, so... This stuff does work wonders. We have used this on adult, adult goats as well. It's got a ton of vitamins in it. It gives them a little energy kick if, you know, if they're not doing good. So I'll put a link down below to where you can purchase this on Amazon. If you guys own goats, it's a must-have just to keep with your other medicines and stuff. It's a, it's a good pick-me-up for these goats. It gives them a boost of energy on the days that they're not feeling good. Let me see if I can't find this baby. All right, guys, here's that little baby right here. This is the lone survivor of the twins. Don't have a name picked out for him yet. Kaya said Smarty, and then I don't... I told her I didn't think that was too good of a name, but she just comes up with random names. And there's old Bear. What do you think, Bear? You don't like being on camera, do you? So anyways, guys, I'm telling you, this little goat yesterday was not full of life at all. This thing, he's starting to worry me. And I got to thinking that he might be sick or something, but we gave him that drench. And chicken cleaning him up there. Gave him that drench and he just got a lot more energy. So if you guys got a sick goat or a little weak goat, get some of this drench and give him a boost of it and... It works wonders. These kids are, I think, going on three weeks old now, and they're starting to eat some of the grain pellets, which is surprising for being that young, but they're eating it. Got my heaters ready to go for the ice and the freezing temperatures coming in. Here's another set of twins. These little boogers are getting hard to catch already. All right guys, so like I said earlier, I'll share a link to this product down in the description to Amazon where you can purchase it. I think it's the cheapest we found it. We try to keep we try to keep it in stock with our other medicines and stuff. It's a great product to have you know like i said if you have a sick goat or whatever uh 
You can get it, I think you can get it at Tractor Supply, but it's a little more expensive. Of course, Amazon, how can you be Amazon's prices? They pretty much own the world. But anyways, let's go check on Daisy. She is still tied up because I don't want to take a chance of her getting out. I'm letting all her hormones kind of run out of her system. So let's see how she's doing. Bear with me, it's pretty dark in here. It's almost dark outside, so we know Daisy. Everybody's wanting to know how you're doing, girl. Hmm? You ready to get off that leash? We let her off the leash. We let her off the leash here and there to go run, but we don't leave her unattended when we're not home and when we're at work. We don't want to end up losing her. Just taking the vet's uh, advice and keeping her locked up for now until all her hormones are hopefully out of her body. I don't think you can hardly see these goats in here. These goats should be right at two months pregnant. Uh, the fattest one should be anyways. This one here is kind of getting a little thick. It's still early in her pregnancy, but like I said, I want to come out here and kind of video some of them just for my own gauging of how fast they grow and such. I know it's dark in here, but... Waiting for this guy to get a little older to see what his horns turn out to look like. Alright guys, that's pretty much all I got for today. Uh, it's almost dark. I got all my chores done real quick as soon as I got home. I really wanted to share this tip with you goat owners out there that asked me, you know, some of the products that we keep on hand for emergencies and stuff. I think this stuff really helped out this baby goat. You know, if a baby goat's sick and don't have the energy to chase his mom around the pasture and get the milk he needs from her he's not going to be growing sufficiently you know he's going to be way behind the other kids so if you see a little goat that's struggling or don't have the energy as of the other little goats give them some of this little power punch give them a little shot fill up a little syringe couple cc's even and it makes a world of difference you guys can see within hours how much energy it gives these goats and no this company don't pay me to sell their product or nothing i'm just helping you guys out because like rachel said before we've had to learn the hard way on all this stuff so anyways guys thanks for watching my videos leave a comment below if you guys got any tips to share and subscribe if you're not subscribed and we'll see you on the next video